Okay, everybody, we just got a shipment. This shipment came in from Narwhal, and we've been looking forward to their new release, the Nautilus Ebonite. Um, and we got two of the three colors in. So we're gonna take a look at these. Okay, so first we'll check out the packaging. For the new Nautilus Ebonite pins, you're gonna get a square box. It still has the great, I love the Narwhal logo. It's just, it's just fun and classy at the same time. Silver on the white box. And inside, I haven't opened these yet, so. This is a true unboxing of the Narwhal Nautilus. Oh, and I forgot to say, the pin that we're gonna unbox first, there are three colors, and this one is the Narwhal Nautilus Cephalopod Black. So that's the one we're gonna look at first. We also, the other colors are Pelagia um, Noctilusi and Bronze Corridoras. So first, the Cephalopod Black and the packaging. We're gonna continue with the packaging. Sorry, got distracted. Got the name Narwhal Nautilus, name the brand and the collection name right there on the outside of the box. And this inside box is also cardboard, but it's a really thick, um, nice gift box. Looks like it's going to be yeah, a little magnetic closure here. So you just open that up, and inside you immediately have a little narwhal paper, classy little thick cardstock here with a user guide on the back. Um, and then at the bottom, you have your information for your for any warranty needs you might have. All right. And then inside, oh, and this is a little soft, um, you know, velvety lined interior with a cutout specifically created for the pen. Overall packaging, lovely. And then you also have a little plastic sleeve to protect your pen a little bit extra there. And this is your Narwhal Nautilus in Cephalopod Black. And it is made of European ebonite. Okay, so let's get a good look at the design here. This is a this is a pin by Narwhal, and it is an oversized piston filler. Um, they we've heard a lot of good feedback about the Narwhal piston fillers. They always used piston fillers until they did release a cartridge converter pin in their last collection, the Key West. But for this Nautilus collection, we're back to the piston filler. So if you missed that on the last one, here you go. All right, one of the most distinctive elements of this design is a proprietary ink window. That ink window immediately um, catches the eye and adds some interest without drawing away from the rest of the pin design. This is the Nautilus collection and it is the Narwhal brand and these proprietary ink windows are reminiscent of the portholes on a ship. Just a really effective way to incorporate their brand and their style into their pins. Okay, so let's just get a look here at the pin clip. You do have the rounded cap and barrel. Your piston knob here is at the bottom of your barrel, and that's how you're gonna operate your piston mechanism. Well, Nautilus uh, Cephalopod Black has the European Ebonite in black, along with black trim. Um, and let's get a good look at the engraving here on the center ring. Got that narwhal name kind of embedded in the swirls there reminiscent of um, waves okay so overall the design elements of this pin you've got the rounded top and bottom you've got the um, european black ebonite both cap and barrel you've got your black trim and that's seen on the, the clip and a small um plate embedded in the crown of the cap. And then the center ring there. Uh, you also see the trim right around the ink windows. And then again, and then again, near the bottom of the barrel, right above your piston knob, you see a thin ring. Okay, it is a threaded cap. Let's take a look at the nib here. Each Narwhal Nautilus fountain pen is gonna be fitted with a stainless steel number six nib, and they're made in-house by Narwhal. And Again, we have, from our customers, we've only heard positive feedback about the Narwhal's in-house nibs. Um, we hear feedback that they're smooth and that they're consistent immediately upon getting them out of the box. Narwhal nibs do tend, the tip of the nib does tend to be a little bit thicker than the standard. So when you're going to choose your nib size, just keep that in mind. The second option you have with your Narwhal Nautilus is is the narwhal nautilus bronze corridoris it also is going to feature that 
black European ebony, but instead of the black trim, you're going to see this um, retro bronze trim. Okay, so let's let you get a good look at that. And it's the same pen design, so you're going to see the trim in all the same places. Um, but just so you can get a look at how this pen looks in action. So you can tell if you're a fan of the black trim or the retro bronze trim. Oh, also one more difference that the Narwhal Nautilus Bronze Corridoras fountain pen is going to feature that same in-house Narwhal nib, number six stainless steel, but it's gold plated. So if you like the look of a gold plated nib, that's happening here. Oh, and you can see um, the nib a little bit better here in the video just because this one's gold plated and the nibs are branded with the Narwhal logo. Other information you might find useful, um, the Narwhal Nautilus pins are not postable. Um, you'll see right away, like even if you want to try to make it, it's not postable. All right, I think that's about everything that needs to be covered. Um, the last item on the agenda is that we, the third color, we have not received yet. We should get it shortly. So right now we've got the Nautilus, the Narwhal Nautilus Bronze Corridoras and the Narwhal Nautilus Cephalopod Black to show you. And as soon as we get it, we will go ahead and show you the Narwhal Nautilus Pelagia Noctiluca. I'm not sure if I remembered the pronunciation of that correctly, but that one is on its way. That third fountain pen is also an oversized piston filler and it's got the same Narwhal Nautilus design. It's part of the same collection, but that particular color is a numbered edition of only 300 pins. Um, and the um, third color on its way is going to feature a rose gold trim with um, a nib plated to match. If you want more information, check it out at pinchlay.com.